Welcome to the third edition of Listen Up Illinois. I'm your host, Ed Hawks, and I'm pleased today to have as my guest the band Big Blue Stem from Urbana, Champaign, Illinois. Um, so uh, first, uh, can I ask you a little bit, can you tell me about the name Big Blue Stem and how you arrived at that name? Well, <clears throat> I'm not sure how we arrived at the name, but uh, at one it. time, not so, not so very far ago, not so very long ago, Illinois was covered with the Big Blue Stem grass. And uh, Becky and who? Becky. Uh, Becky came it was Becky's name. idea. I did plant Becky's biology idea. a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> well, that we were going to do Illinois tunes, That's Illinois right. history, and, and uh, other tunes too, but uh, that, that would be representative. And nobody else in the area had a name like it. That helped. So Big Blue Stem is a, a prairie grass. That's yes, right. Right. Yeah. Okay, great. So you have another tune for us? Sure. Yeah, the old horse think. and buggy. Is that next? Huh? And the fox. Oh, yes. Well, uh, Kathleen had to retune for the first two tunes, which were um, Big John O'Neill and Oxford Town. And so she's tuning now from one key to another key, is that? From A to D. Yeah, from, well, from A to a regular so tune. So when, when you put the fiddle in A, you have to tune one of the strings to a different note, is that? It makes it convenient sometimes. Yeah. That sounds good. Oh, Thank you. 
great. Uh, that was the old horse and buggy and the fox. Now, where did that song uh, come from, Becky? Do you know? Well, I remember hearing it as a child, and I love the line, the little ones chewed yeah. on the bones, though. And <laughs> <laughs> Kathleen also happened to know it, so we just kind of resurrected it from It's an English song. Yeah. And, and in fact, the, the one title where we go, he ran until he came to a great big bin, the ducks and the geese were kept within. The English version goes, he grabbed the grapes by the sleeve, and he said, Mrs. Goose, with your reap was out reprieve. I'll carry you away. And it's very English. Yeah. <laughs> but it came over here, and it got much blunter and more direct.